It has been all about getting to this stage, and two teams have made it. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by Stuart Robson. We're just moments away from kickoff time in the UEFA Europa Conference League final. It is Chelsea versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, what a final this should be. Both these sides have played some great football to get here. I just hope we see them at their best today. This should be a great game. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. Edouard Mendy starts in goal. Andreas Christensen plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And operating an attack today is Romelu Lukaku. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea between the posts. Harry Maguire plays with Victor Lindelof in central defence. And up front, Marcus Rashford starts together with Cristiano Ronaldo. Mount Conte now Timo Werner Romelu Lukaku now well it's one pass after another I just couldn't play that decisive ball Sancho now can they create something and tossing through and top notch as well as brave goalkeeping well, he comes off his line at just the right time. He read that brilliantly. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. Doing well to keep possession. Strong but fair tackle. Bruno Fernandes. It's a fine United move in the making. Very comfortable when in possession. Goro Conte and Mount opportunity to deliver the cross so deflection and they can get ready for the corner kick routine Now sending it in. And he's clear his lines. Difficult to stop him. Timo Werner. Werner. And a goal for Chelsea! They hit the front in the final. How important will that be? Well, we can take another look now. It's great interplay between the two of them to start the move off. But the keeper should do better in his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. So United restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with an equaliser? Bruno Fernandes. Scott McTominay. Fred. Here's Ronaldo. It's with McTominay. Rashford. Sancho. Back for Sancho. He made it look simple, really. Rhys James. Christensen. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Lukaku. 
Wonderfully weighted pass. Well, quite simply, the cross was too close to the keeper. Fred. Scott McTominay. A lot of forward thrust here from Ronaldo. Now, what can he do from this excellent position? Surely the equaliser. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. Delivering it. Oh, super header, but the goalkeeper was up to the task. Corner kick forthcoming. <laughs> Who can he pick out? Attending to his defensive chores. Rashford Bruno Fernandes has it he's protecting it effectively in position Bruno Fernandes oh a goal it is the equaliser in this final what next in the drama well here it is again and the defending simply isn't good enough they have to react quicker, deal with the danger and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. So the whistle then, we're at the halfway stage in this match. Into the second half then, and these two sides are locked together. Just can't really choose between them at the moment. Conte. And the ball with Christensen. And Golo Conte. Now with Jorginho. Conte. Mount. An important interception. Sancho. Here is Fred. Scott McTominay. Encouraging stuff from United. Rashford. Sancho. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. Ronaldo, and dispossessed. And into the last 30 minutes now. N'Golo Conte. Really nice ball. And the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Defensive efficiency personified. And a throw in forthcoming. Fred. And back with Fred. Keeping it moving dynamically. Rashford. United looking to forge ahead. Let's see if the corner helps them.
And there's the delivery. Well, it has come to nothing. McTominay. On to Sancho. Rashford! And there it is! They take command in the final. And just look at the celebrations here. Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Christensen. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Well, with the minutes ticking away, United on the cusp of recording a victory in this one. Your assessment of their performance, Stuart? Well, they should have had this wrapped up long ago. Some of their football has been excellent, but they're going to need to be resilient in these final few minutes to get their much-deserved victory. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. And now the delivery, and he makes the save, and a good thing too. Well, what a save it is. But can they now go and get that equaliser? They favoured a short one here. Pulls it back. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Mount. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left. And just one goal between the sides. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. And return to Mount. And using his strength to shield the ball. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Bruno Fernandes. Sancho. McTominay. A very good tackle. N'Goro Conte. Timo Werner. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition.
But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Full marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. Yeah, really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.